Hey guys, this is Michael Photos by Mike, and today I'm going to be doing a unboxing of the new DJI mic set. Brand new, they just came out at the end of this month, uh, about a week ago, and we're going to go ahead and unbox one right here. So I'm going to switch over to my overhead so you can see the box and see what I'm getting ready to do. So we'll go right over to my overhead. And so here's your box. This is the actual DJI box with the kit inside of it. I got my little trusty dusty Swift switch, Swift switch army knife, Swiss army knife that I'm gonna go ahead and open the box up with. And just pulling the cellophane wrapper off the top of it. And then Paper on the ground, look around and see how these cool boxes are opening. So here's your opening right here. It actually has a little pull tie. And pull it out, open it up, and pull out the big part, which is all your instructions and booklets and pouch. It has a really good carry pouch has a has a fuzzy thing like the one that I'm wearing right now so it has your little wind foamy thing this is an actual um, ceremonic blink 500 pro and I wanted to check them out against each other which I will do probably in a future video we got to see how this goes but let's go back to the to the um, unboxing here's a USB to USB C cord right here here's a TRS cord data cord in the pouch itself it's got something hard in there ah booklet it's in three different languages which we only need one registration information but it doesn't show anything on it and let's see what else is in here i think that's it nothing but lint now and that's what you have for there and then the actual product itself which is really small I'll pull off the plastic wrapper and you can see it fits right in the palm of my hand so it's really good it has a USB charging port here so that the things can charge in the case kind of like my um, ceremonics and I'll show you that case in a second and then you have the top with the DJI and you just open it and you can see the lights automatically come on when you open it it's it's got four it's got three lights on here to show the levels and then you have two transmitters they're really small they're smaller than the ceremonic and they have a magnet piece right here that can come off so that you don't have to use the um the actual clip you can take the magnet put it on and this is uh metal so it clips to the magnet and it allows you to uh, wear it without having to clip it onto you so you can wear it through your shirt. Okay. And when you put it back in, it automatically starts charging. Both of them go in. Now this is the actual receiver. And you can see on the receiver, I don't know how, how far you can see, but you can see on the receiver, it actually has a touch screen. So you can actually change, put it in English for your language hit the button to next and it'll ask you to put in your date and all that other good stuff. It has a ear a earpiece setting for wearing earphones. It has an out setting to go out to your your camera and it has some pins in the back and these pins go to the uh, connectors. Now you have a connector that that you use for your phone which is the iPhone flash connector and it shows you how to slip it on you just 
put it on and slide it in. Oh, that's wrong. Put it on and slide it in. It's got two arrows, one arrow right here that shows you which direction and the arrow down here showing you the direction. So you just put it in and slide it in. And now you can plug that into your cell phone like this. And you can have it work right off of your cell phone. So I'll pull that back out. Put this one back off. Now, if your cell phone runs off of USB-C, if your cell phone runs off of USB-C, it also has a USB-C adapter to hook up to your cell phone. You also have a small clip that you can clip on like these clips to your um, camera shoe. So this can work as a camera on the camera shoe also. And what this does is this piece right here actually hooks onto the camera shoe and then this piece right here actually hooks into your um onto your um device so that you can plug it on there and put it on you use it as a camera shoe so that's pretty much it that's what comes with this it also shows your battery levels right here on the screen so you could tell how charged up the actual receiver is which is in the middle you could tell how how charged up these two are and when they're off that's pretty good because now when this is on somebody when your transmitter is on somebody you can look at your receiver and you can see it's not on so it won't tell you while it's off but you can see exactly how much power you have left in your actual transmitter on the person and while they're in here they're all charging you can see the little charge symbol I don't know how well you can see it. I'll bring it up a little bit. But you can see the little charge symbol on there showing you that it's being that it's charged or being charged by the case which is lit up right here. And these can also be charged outside of the case. They have a USB um, plug on the side. A USB-C plug on the side. So you can use the case to charge everything. And this USB-C plug that comes with it you can actually plug into the back side of here and charge it while you're on the go up against the wall or whatever and it'll charge all three pieces at the same time now let me show you what I'm wearing right now which is the um, Ceramonic Blink 500 Pro It's a much bigger case as you can see, compare the cases to each other. And this one is more portable, it, it, it's built really sturdy. It actually feels heavier than this one and it's bigger. But this one lays down and it charges all of your pieces in here like that and you can see them charge. But it's the same thing as this. When you open this up, you can actually see them charge. But this one, the receiver shows you each one of them charging. One, one of the big things I like about the, the DJI one is if I lose connection, which sometimes I've lost connection on the Ceremonic, if I lose connection, it, there's a record button right here on the side. And I'll try to bring it up so you can see it. But this is your record button. So I can actually record with the transmitter at the same time I'm transmitting the signal to the receiver that's going into whatever whatever um device i have it going into now the other thing about the receiver is the receiver has a usb charge on the side just like the transmitters so i could charge it separately if i have to but it also has an out which i could take that trs cable plug it in and plug it right into my camera so there's no need of me having to to do anything i can put this right onto my camera and the receiver is really really small And when you pl plug it back in, it shows you the charge. It shows you how much this is charged. So if you have to charge this, this does the same thing. And on the Ceremonic, but the Ceremonic doesn't feel quite as, and there's the USB charging 
USB-C charger right there. The Ceramonic doesn't feel quite as durable as the DJI's. These feel, it feel a little bit heavier, but if you look at the size, the size compared to there, both on the side and on front, this one's bigger. Now, this has an on-screen, I'll turn this on. This has an on-screen menu that you can see when I'm talking through it. You can see the, the levels. You can see the sound level. So you can see it right here on this. This doesn't. But it does have a green light, and this little notch on the other side is the recording light. So when you push the record button, that'll turn red. So you can visually see what it's doing. You just can't get all the little specifications, the signal length, signal strength, and all of that good stuff on it. But this doesn't have a magnet. It has a clip to your clothes. This does, you can clip it through your clothes. This has a clip also that you can clip. These both have microphones on the top. There's the microphone for uh, the DJI and there's the microphone for the Ceramonic. They both have outputs that to go to a lav mic, which is right here and right here. Now, here's the thing. The DJI doesn't come with a lav mic. The Ceramonic does come with two lav mics. Is it a big deal? It's not really a killer because I can go out and buy a lav mic. They don't ca they don't cost that much if I really need them. But these are really small and they're really actually even though they may feel a little bit heavier, they they I don't know, it just feels a little bit different. Hey Tim, tell me what you think about these. I have Tim Collins who has generously allowed me to open his his mic set. Uh, they both light, super light. Even a bigger one, super light. You can talk into that mic. The other one. Oh, yeah. oh, this is recording. Yeah. Um, they're both light, super light. I like the screen though, but you know when you throw it on somebody, they don't need to. Yeah. You can see it all from there. You can see the it all from there. The shooter, the uh, the DP. Yeah. So now, a look, another couple of things. So you do get, now this is what I've been looking at. There's only one fuzzy cover for this that I saw in the box. I don't see another fuzzy cover. So you might have to buy another one. It only comes with one. The other thing is, is that this actually has a microphone wand that you can make it like a regular mic and the wand when it's installed if you push the button the well you see the blue light which means it's actually charging now it's charging this so if i run out of battery power on here i can put it on the wand and charge it through the wand while i'm still talking also this has a the ceremonic also has a cover wind cover that goes on to it like that so you can use it as a regular studio mic and it works this it works the same thing but the big thing that i really like about the ceremony or the dji is that you can record uh, and and transmit at the same time these don't record all they do is transmit and receive so I'd like to do a distant test, but these this needs to be charged first, and he'll take it home and he'll get it charged. This needs to be charged set. These things are out of stock everywhere, everywhere. So I, I was happy that he went went ahead and got his, and I'm glad that he allowed me to um, to do the open box here, so you can see everything it comes with. Like I said, you get the case, which is a self charging case. You get the Trans, two transmitters, a receiver. You have different connections that allow it to hook up, which the Ceramonic doesn't. The Ceramonic has one line out and it has a microphone on the top. So you can use a lavalier for this. It also doesn't have USB-C chargers. It has a regular USB charger. It does have volume set. It doesn't have a record button. It does have a mute button, which the DJI's have a mute button also. These also have a link button. This doesn't need a link button because the Ceramonic will pair 
inside the case. And these are supposed to pair in the case also, but you can pair them outside of the case using the link button. You also have a power button on here, which also acts as a mute button. So, and you have a USB-C charger. So with the Ceramonix, I need two different charging cables at some times if I want to charge outside of the box. With this, I only need the USB charging cable and that's why they gave you one. You get a, so once again, just to go over it, in the DJI, you get the case, which is a charging case, which has a charging port in the back. You get two transmitters, one receiver, you get extra plugs, you get a plug, um, you get a flash plug for your cell phones, you get a USB-C plug, and you have a holder that you can put in that you can mount it to your camera if you're carrying it around. You also get a TRS cable, which will plug into this and plug into your camera, or you could just go ahead and go side to side here. If you don't want to use the mic outside, you could buy a lavalier, which you have to buy additionally, but they're cheap. And you can run a lavalier on your side, and these are really, really small. They're smaller than these, but they weigh about the same. So, and these feel more sturdy. The DJI's feel more sturdy. You also get a little Chiron pouch. You get a case with the, um, with the Ceramonics also. You get a, a kind of a hard cover case. And that's this case right here, which opens up and you can put this inside. So you get a hard cover and it's got a handle. With the DJI, you get a, like a pouch and all your stuff goes inside of the pouch, which is cool. I definitely li like it. I really like it because of two other things. The, um, the DJI is smaller. It's a smaller footprint. It'll probably be easier to store away and, and carry. You can see it's like half the size of the case. Um, and then if you stack them side by side, you can see that they're almost the same. They're the same thickness. But one is longer than the other one. So, I don't know. As for portability, this would be great. And when you sit it inside of here in the carrying pouch, it's just, it's like a no-brainer. So, in that aspect, oh, wait, I found it. It does have two fuzzy covers. It was in the case. So, you get just about everything that you get with the Ceramonic. Now, as for quality, quality, I have to test that out again. Like I said, it has to be charged up before I can use it. But this is just an unboxing, so we're letting you see what it is. And this is the DJI microphone set against the Ceramonic Blink 500. Now, Ceramonic does have a Blink 900 Pro right now. They have a B2 and a B1 kit. A, the B1 and B2 only means you get one transmitter or two transmitters. But they, but all the receivers work on a two transmission system. Same thing with the DJI; it has a two transmission system. So you can, you can, if you break one of these, you can order one and pair it by sticking it in the case, and it'll pair up to your system. So easy fix, easy carry. This, I'm telling you, the feel, the build quality on this feels excellent, dude. This is wow, more than I expected. So, that's it for me. Um, I'm done right now. I'm getting ready to go. Getting ready to go. My friend Tim has to leave here in a minute. I will talk to you guys later. Uh, it's Mike of Photos by Mike. Making life stand still. One picture at a time. I'll catch you guys later.